side. Flowers, he doesn't. Oh, he, he just, they had three black jerseys down there, and he just ran right by them. He is an All-America. Top players early in the year. Hubbard from outside, their leading score off the back of the rim. This is where Kentucky really dangerous in transition. And it's Darius Miller, the sophomore from the first. Inside to Patterson. And he banks in an easy eight unanswered by Kentucky. Ten unanswered by the Cats. And a foul. Should do it. And John Wall in transition. He's got great vision. Left the floor to make the pass. And again. This freshman has had a sensational year with assists. Not a bad shooter either. John Wall. Wall passes up the three, moves in for the two. And along with his shooting, John Wall has 210 assists. That's a record. It's not like this team hasn't been challenged. It hasn't. Bledsoe for three. They just shoot it so well. Wow, did a good job getting that shot up, but doesn't just made it shoot over. Bledsoe wants to UCLA and Bill Walton. Patterson inside, having it his own way. And Cubs, who has a couple of threes early, misses that one. Wall checking the floor as he brings it down court, finds his buddy Bledsoe, and Bledsoe at 24 gets it back out to Patterson. Wall's turn to shoot a three. Oh, man. Lock up the Cupid dolls, close the carnival. They're taking all the toys home, Kentucky. Shooting lights out, 11 for 18 from three-point range. It's 72, 35. Wall to wall shooting. I don't think they think that. <laughs> John Wall still in the game just to prove that he hasn't lost his touch. It's Lucas Pavras, freshman from Lithuania. Wall, wall. Well, I don't know if he called it off the glass. Great wall of Lexington. Boom. What a player. 11, 6 11 win. Oh, meeting at the summit. And Wall at the other end nails the three. White there, unable to get the shot down. And at the other end, it's DeAndre Liggins for two. LD Williams sent right back. Wall fires from long range and hits the three. Wall gets a screen from Morton and walks in. Well, that was a great read by John Wall He's on the other the end. McFarland on the high side. Nobody can cut off the baseline. He just blows right by Ishmael Smith. John Wall, three of five on the game, two of three from three-point range. When he gets his feet set, he is a good jump shooter, and he can certainly get to the rim. Nine points. And the ball further behind with Alper and Benito on the bench. What a pass by Wall that sets up an easy two for Cousins. What a pass by John Wall. It's got to be something that Benito can get. What a pass again. How did Wall thread that one through with the backhand? Even when you think you've got him going at an angle that's away from the basket, he's able to just throw a little backhanded pass. New career high in the NCAA tournament. Seven for eight tonight. Bledsoe, who went eight for nine from outside the line. Well, Kentucky has moved out this lead the first five minutes of the second half, and John Wall has been magnificent. His passing, just incredible. Finding open people. Inside John Wall, 11 for 11. And we quickly by Darius Miller. And it's Wall the other way. Liggins is fouled plus one. Kentucky is tied. And with this free throw attempt, can take its first lead. Run outs. The nice steal by Darius Miller after the drive, the baseline drive by Ryan Whitman. And Adam Wire can't afford to foul there. You're given an easy basket and then a chance for the conventional three point play. At the line, DeAndre Liggins, the sophomore. Good feed from foot. A little quick on the shot because Orton changed it. Patterson, the big man, the junior outside, the nail of one fall. So the strength of this Cornell team straight, and this is the strength of the Wildcats. It's By John Wall. That's just a great pass ahead. And go down. Now it comes to Wall. Here come the Cats. And look at the speed. Oh, oh, oh. Miller. Set up by Wall. Praise in the game. Here's Whitman 
Harris by Wall. He sets up. No, it is Wall. As Miller was the one with the defense, sets up Wall. Usually it's the other way around. The unselfish Wall, he has a free trip. John Wall in transition to Darius Miller with the great finish. Kentucky exerting its strength in Syracuse. History of basketball at Cornell. But they're playing a team that's a number one seed for a good reason. And there field by Patterson sets up Bledsoe. Bledsoe to Wall. They're making it look easy. These only three shots in the game. The penetration by Wall draws everybody into the lane. A long closeout to Darius Miller for Ryan Whitman couldn't get there and anytime there's a turnover they are just passing the ball ahead and very quick. This is a talented team. Hello John Wall. Long pass ahead to Blitz. Oh! Wall! And a spectacular finish for Kentucky. An exclamation point on a spectacular defensive performance. It rattles out. Here comes Wall the other way. Two on two. Gets his own rebound and scores. How quick was that second jump? Joe Missoula looked like he was there. This is on his three. Here come the Wildcats down by two. A one man fast break. Wall, what a pass to Cousins. Freshman to freshman to tie it at six. Cousins. Look at this pass, just threads it right underneath the arm of Wellington Smith. Just don't see. Passes like that. Deshaun Butler tries to get down and knock it away. Azula coast to coast and then denied by Patterson and the save by Wall. It was almost a no look block. And look at Wall just so quickly down court plus a foul. There's an example of defense leading to offense, and this has been how Kentucky has played all year long. It's it's almost like Patrick Patterson was giving Joe Missoula the look away and daring him to come in there and then just wiped it away. And John Wall, that's all he needs. Well, John Wall, in his last six games, averaging over 15 points per game and over eight assists per game. He's also averaged four turnovers, but he has been absolutely magnificent. He just understands the game. He plays with great pace. Went right off Wall into the backcourt. No West Virginia player touched it. And then Wall comes in and... Oh, that's punishing. And Missoula gets it for West Virginia. And he's blocked by Wall. Oh, my. What a talent. He is an All-America, all-around player. He can score. He can pass. And look at him play defense. John Wall. To Patterson. Wall again to Cousins. Oh, my. Do they get down the court with a ball in Wall's hand. He's the a terrific outlet pass. And John Wall making himself available. And DeMarcus Cousins, as soon as he saw the ball was heading the other way, he immediately took off, had his hands ready. That, that was a challenge shot. He should have put it on the deck. All the way goes John Wall and draws the foul. And Wall, he can get from one end to the other as quickly without it looking as if he's that fast. And the, the bad shot by John Flowers was the first pass in Kentucky's fast break. That put Joe Missoula in a bad spot. He slid right underneath. And John Wall with that great body balance and body control. Now, who team says pulled off outside? Flowers, he doesn't. Oh, he, he just, they had three black jerseys down there, and he just ran. Look at him split the defense, maneuver his body, and score. John Wall to Kentucky. Kentucky needs to continue to get the ball to the rim. Dodson for three. Oh, big free throws by Wellington Smith. Way outside and banks it in, John Wall. A big three from Wall as he... Final minute. Wall spins. Tip. Recovered by West Virginia. Flowers, poorest free throw shooter, will go to the line for the Mountaineers with 51.3 seconds to go. John Wall is fouled out for Kentucky. He'll get votes for the player of the year in the nation. He's the freshman player of the year. He's been brilliant. And tonight he carried Kentucky on an off shooting night. 19 for him. Nine rebounds and five assists for Wall.